I'm getting rather bothered by the number of these doors they have back here. It's like they use to hide something more than just what's beyond the door. Authorized personnel only, huh? Screw your rules, I have the ability to rebel said rules. Wait, where am I even going? Wait a minute... Is this the... Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. Well, not the name per se, but this is definitely a scrapping line for destroyed turrets. So, let's see where this goes. Hopefully in the way of forward. Portal up there and over here and then you know the drill. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Please exit the turret redemption line. Fine. I was gonna do that anyway. Besides, I'd rather do some precise platforming type maneuvering than ride on a conveyor belt, obviously. Not a rebel movement! I'm rebelling all over the place! I'm sure you are- wait a minute, I was the turret from- Alright, I'm curious. Why aren't you saying the same things as the other turrets? Besides, get mad at what? GLaDOS? Well, obviously. Don't make lemonade. Prometheus was punished by the gods for giving the gift of knowledge to man. He was cast into the bowels of the earth and picked by birds. That's... Um... A bit creepy. It won't be enough. You know what? I'm just gonna leave you here because you're starting to scare me, little turret guy. Why do I have a feeling that that turret there was actually more than just a turret? You know, for someone who's trying to think about escaping, I'm thinking a lot more about other things that don't involve escaping. And this door is locked. Or indefinitely closed, considering there's no actual locks on it. Hmm, seems like a turret shooting range. Well, look at that. Looks like Aperture's building bots have been slacking a bit. We've got defective turrets now. Oh hey, there's a portable surface over there, and I can't hit it because it's behind the glass. Hmm. Oh, wait. There's one up there that I can get to, however. So, let's go over there and then figure out what to do after that. Hmm. Okay, so, is there another surface nearby that I can get to? Alright, there is. And I note that the surface with the giant target on it is one, too. So now I just need to pop out and go through when a defective turret goes by. Alright, go, go, go! Jeez, <sighs> that was close. Alright, let's get out of here before a working turret sees me through the portals. That wouldn't be good. So wait, why isn't this room before the firing range? Well, I guess it wouldn't make much of a difference either way. It's not like the turrets not following the template aren't going to be thrown into the other incinerator. Right, forgot that's where the turrets were going on the redemption line. For now though, I should just keep going this way until I find that all guy. And there he is. Am I? If it's what I'm thinking of, then I'm inclined to agree. Almost there. Da -da! Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. Damn it, thought it'd be pie. See that scanner right there, right? It's deciding which turrets to keep and which to toss. And it's using that master turret there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template turret, it'll shut down the whole production line. Right, um, hmm. I'm gonna have to hack the door so that we can get at it. Technical, um, you'll need to turn around while I do. Turn around! I'll only be a second, if you wouldn't mind. God. Just, just turn right, right the way fine. So Betty's just gonna smash the window. Guess as much. Okay, go on, just pull that turret out. Alright, let's get in there the new fashioned way. Well, that should do it. Template missing. Continuing from memory. Oh, that hasn't done it. Yeah. Alright, let's figure out how to stop this turret line. Template. Have you got any ideas? Uh, any ideas? Any ideas? No? Uh, hmm. Go. Actually, I do. But I'm not telling you about it. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, have you got an idea? Template. Response. Okay, well, alright, just do your idea and then come straight back. Okay, so, if 
anyone's listening, here's my idea. If that scanner can accept new templates, I can change out the template from one of a normal functioning to it to one of the broken ones. And it looks like this little area over here is the perfect spot to fly fish for them. Even though they're not fish, they're turrets. And now we play the waiting game. Ooh, here comes one now. Response. All you'll find out eventually, my little broken friend. You'll find out soon enough. <laughs> I really gotta stop doing that evil laughter stuff. Oh, this? It's my little friend. The idea. What, what are you? Oh, brilliant! It's brilliant. That's brilliant. Response. New template accepted. If we're lucky, she won't find out all her turrets are crap until it's too late. <laughs> Classic. Okay, keep your eye on the turret line. I'm gonna go and hack the door open. Template. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. It's a little bit more complicated than it looked from your side. It should take about ten minutes. Keep one eye on the door. Yeah, yeah, I'll keep it. Oh. Well, then I guess I'll just walk through here. Now that the door is open ten minutes ahead of time. This door's actually pretty complicated. Oh, how long's the door been open? I mean, was there any sort of announcement before it opened? Like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind? Or like a hacker alert? I mean, you know, fair enough, the important thing is it's open. But it's, in, it's just mentioned in the future. Cough or something. Or talk? Oh, wait, I can't. All right, now, she can't use her turrets, so let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. Okay, neurotoxin... walkway is blocked off. Looks like the only way to go is left. Oh, and you can't come this way because there's no rail. Right. Bring your daughter to work day. That did not end well. Is everything a goddamn potato? And 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realize they're children, but still, you know. Low hanging fruit and all that. Barely science, really, is it? Baking soda volcano. Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery, I'll give it that, but it's not terrifically original, is it? You know what I mean? Not exactly primary research, even within the child sciences. I'm guessing this wasn't one of the scientists' children. You know, I don't want to be snobby, but let's be honest, it's got it's got manual labour written all over it, hasn't it? I'm not saying they're not as good as the professionals, you know, they're just they're just a lot done. You know, that's kinda rude. Yeah, these aren't high. Whoa! Look at that, it's growing right up into the ceiling. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? At least you won't starve, though. Well, that explains why the place is overrun with plant growth. It's because of a potato. Never thought I'd say that in my life, to be honest. I'm pretty sure we're going the right way, just to reassure you. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing you 100% that it's this way. No, it's not this way. Okay, let's try this way. I was going to say something during the walk down here, but I think the situation speaks for itself. So, how big is this place anyways? I mean, it can't be all that big. I mean, how big is the near toxin chamber gonna be? Hey, holy crap. Ha! I knew we were going the right way. This is the neurotoxin generator. Bit bigger than I expected. Uh, not going to be able to just, you know, push it over. Have to apply some cleverness. There's some sort of control room up at the top, so uh, let's go and investigate. Right. Let's... Jesus. I sure hope there's a simple solution to take it this thing down. I mean, damn! This place is huge! It's like the size of Test Chamber 10. <laughs> there's our handiwork. I shouldn't laugh, really. They do feel pain of a sort. It's all simulated, you know. But uh, really enough for them, I suppose. Not gonna comment on that one. That's some deep thinking I need to do before coming up with the. You know what? Forget it. I'm not even gonna say anything about it at all. I'm afraid the door's locked. Just checked it. No way to hack it as far as I can hmm. tell. What does this button do? What are you doing? We don't know what that button. Oh, the door's open. Well done. Let's see what's. Good news. I can use this equipment to shut down the neurotoxin system. It is, however, password protected. Ah, alarm bells. No, don't worry. All right, not a problem for me. You may as well have a little rest actually while I work on it. Okay, here we go. The hardest part of any hack is the figuring out how to start a phase. That's always tricky, but let the games begin. All right, what have we got? The computer. 
You know what, I'm just gonna see what's over here. I have a funny feeling that this little scenario is gonna involve this laser somehow. Hmm... Moving portable surfaces... I wonder... Do you smell neurotoxin? Hold up, the neurotoxin levels are going down! So whatever you're doing, keep doing Well, this seems to be the solution to the problem. Hold on, something's wrong! Neurotoxin levels up to 50%! No, it's dang. Sorry, my mistake is... I, I, said, I meant to say it's dang 50%. It's good news, carry on. Still going down. Still Alright, only a couple more to go. Can we do this? That did it! Neurotoxin at zero percent. Yes! Hold on. Warning. Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. Um, the piping is scrunched. Oh god. Straight to her! I can't hold on! Come on! Come on! Wah! 